Here we go, this way, that way. Walking will get you so far. Subway. It's no, there's no um, 28th Street train station where I work at. He hops on a bike, a city bike to be specific, but riders have detected a reoccurring issue with the blue things. They're missing. I've been using city bike for a couple of months now, and I noticed that they're the bikes do tend to run out. Here's the map from Thursday evening after the rush about 7.15 p.m. The green dots represent areas with bikes and the red dots are areas that need them. This is not an infrequent situation at this particular station or a number of the stations in this part of Park Slope. Eric McClure lives in Park Slope. He works with his community board and an advocacy group dedicated to street safety and mobility. I think it's clear that we need to find ways to help motivate or help lift, expand the city bike system. Um, it's time to keep that momentum going forward. Each day this week, about 70,000 city bike rides happened. That's the way it usually goes when it's nice out. City Bike says the average ride per day is 38,000, and that number increases every year. The company sent out a service alert at the end of September and confirmed it again to me this week. There are lower than usual levels of bike availability due to unusual damage on some handlebars. Crews have stepped up repairs, the media representative tells me. They've also changed the way crews circulate and look for bikes with problems. Riders can now earn points by helping out. People get bonus time on their subscription by returning bikes to areas that need them. 